I basically just used the um, those little makeup wipe things it's a reusable makeup wipe basically and you just put water on it I got it at Walmart it came with a beauty blender it was like two dollars and it was at like the holiday thing I had another one a long time ago that I got in an ipsy box but I don't know what ever happened to it I think I left it at my boyfriend's house forever and ever ago so I just used it basically to like so you don't clog up your your makeup brushes now I do have some darkness uh, makeup under here that I didn't really get good so you can see that the there's a little bit that I need to clean up that's got caught in my crease right there just like the black from like mascara and eyeliner but I basically just wiped it all down and then I took my clean and clear cleanser let me show you what one I used and then I can get rid of this I know you guys are like why are you showing me this this is a food channel weight loss channel um it is but at the same time I get people that ask me this of course like a dog hair just appears nowhere and you don't even have to like like rub it all over your face like very gentle there we go i guess i'm just tired i didn't really sleep that much either because i usually don't have bags under my eyes but i didn't go to bed till like 3 a.m yeah i just got bags under my eyes today um but yeah this is it i i've rinsed it off clean it with just like in the washing machine and then i use this in the morning in the daytime to clean my face clean and clear morning burst this smells good like citrusy and then this one at night when I wash my face this is I don't know it's like a lavendery it, it does it it's very calming this face cleaner spin brush I don't remember what this is called it comes with a body scrubber it comes with an exfoliator a face cleaner and like a pumice stone body scrubber attachment is about this big I uh, I actually Tana Mojo she constantly has it on her channel and she one year I think it was last year around this time she had like a holiday special the thing is like 40 bucks but I got it for 25 using her code I don't know I, I could not tell you what this is called because literally the name is not on it but it's just a face scrubber and I like it so I'm just sitting here editing some videos they're really short videos because I don't know the days after Christmas and stuff it was just really short I wasn't really vlogging much however I promised that I would do all of vlogmas and I have kept my word I also promise that my videos are gonna be a little bit better not just here's a pick of what I ate today okay bye like if I if I don't have enough to upload that day like after vlogmas then I'm gonna save it for one video like I hate releasing one to two minute videos I feel like that's like wasting your guys's time uh, I'm I apologize for that so my plans for today today is Thursday New Year's Eve my plans for today is I have some lottery tickets that I'm going to go turn in I had gotten lottery tickets as presents from other co-workers and I ended up winning $17 on those I turned those in bought more tickets and I won $40 from those now since I need money I'm going to take that $40 I'm going to turn it in take that $40 to go to Hobby Lobby and get myself a new planner for 2021 I'm really excited about that um, it won't be anywhere near $40 but maybe I'll be able to get a good sticker pack with it obsessed with stickers for my planners obsessed a lot of the times Hobby Lobby doesn't have like really good choices for planners because they're always so picked over and the website I don't want to wait for things to come there is like a sale going on I could always make a planner from all old planners like just like construct one and have like a planner Frankenstein a Franken planner uh, if you will but 
I'm on my second cup of coffee. You've seen me make it. It's just, I'm using up the rest of those K-Cup, the chocolate cherry. It's good, but it's not Bones. I'm telling you, the flavor in Bones is so much stronger than these K-Cups. But I've never tried like the Walmart brand flavored K-Cups, but I hear that those are really, really good. Um, I do have to go on Bones and see what my referral points are, and I might use that to buy some new coffee. I feel like people don't use my link for Bones like they used to use my my um, my um referral link. Is that weird? Like I, I used to get referral after referral after referral for Bones, but now when it's the link where if you use the link, then I make money off of it. Like nobody does it, I don't know. It's so weird. Maybe it doesn't give you as much off. Either way, you can use either one. If you wanna use the link or you wanna use the other one, the referral, it's fine by me. One way I get money, one way I get coffee. So I'm fine with that. Speaking of kickbacks, a lot of people have been ordering Built Bars lately and I'm thankful for that. I had no idea and I have like $60 in my Built Bar wallet so I could choose to either have a payout on Friday, which is tomorrow, or I can use that to buy more Built Bars. Since they just sent me that affiliate package yesterday, I don't have to buy any more Built Bars. So I'm cashing out. Also, I did reach out to the company about the small hoodie and they said um I could go on a Facebook group and maybe swap it with somebody I just gave it to Tiffany although I think it's really kind of weird to not ask the people that you're sending things to what size they wear and just sending out random sizes I think that's really kind of crappy I don't know maybe I'm just being grumpy but I'm thankful for it but at the same time is it really a good business move if you send out sizes to people that can't wear the sizes and they can't really wear it and advertise it so it's kind of like a waste of money on the business's part either way i'm still very thankful tiffany got a new hoodie and it's it's a breast cancer awareness hoodie i just wish that i could wear it <laughs> so i just finished editing day 26 and it's like a one minute and 37 second video oh my god i did show you two things i ate that day it was just a lot of driving that day because that's the day that we went home so okay oh did i show you this is my gift from chris it's a, he a wireless headset steel series my old headset was steel series but it was wired so i'm really excited about this love it all right so finish editing get ready oh guys today cory got a job cory got a job so he went and applied at wendy's the other day and they called him the next day and they had him come in the the that day or the day after i think it was the day after he went in and he applied they told him to come back again yesterday he went for another interview yesterday and then he starts today so yesterday his dad sent some money and we got him a pair of black pants and a pair of non-slip shoes black shoes for work and he starts today at 11 it's 10 o'clock now so he starts in an hour he's gonna work until six o'clock and i'm just really excited for him let me tell you i have the best kids in the world because you remember i had so many comments like oh your kids are so sweet because when i asked them what they wanted for christmas peyton was like i just want a phone charger and four dollars for roblox <laughs> so i told Corey how proud of him i was and how exciting this was and he said i know i'm so excited i can finally help you out and my heart about melted because what kid is, is thinking about getting a job to start getting money to help their mom out with bills? I'm gonna cry thinking about it. But it just shows like what kind of heart he has. And he's a good kid. And I said, and you can save for a car and buy things that you wanna buy. Like this is really exciting for you, of course. Yes, that'll be really helpful for me, but you know, this is an exciting time for you. I want I wanna teach him to be more responsible with his money and not and not make like, all the mistakes I made. I'm crying, this is so stupid. All right, I'm gonna go finish editing and stop crying like a little baby because my son starts work today. <laughs> all right, so we went to the store and I got my planner stuff and uh, picked up some chorizo Johnsonville sausages and some original. I'm cooking those in the Ninja. So I picked up some sweet potato fries and some tater tots and some mac and cheese for the kids, buns for them. I'm going to be having mine plain, plain old Jane, plain boring Jane. Some pork rinds probably, I think I have some up here. 
let me know if you guys would be interested in seeing a what's my snack cabinet. There's all kinds of things up here. Let me know if that's something you're interested in. I do have some pork rinds left, so I will be having pork rinds with that. Um, mostly, mostly it's just like crackers and some beef sticks and uh, I never did try this. And these are my bars. All right, guys, I absolutely scored with this. I had a gift card for Meyer for $25 from work and this smell is cookies by the fire and obviously link really likes the smell of it for some reason okay um cookies by the fire it was on the shelf for twenty dollars all the candles around it it's a three wick it's a very large candle i was going to use my gift card on it because it smelled absolutely amazing and it's a yankee candle so get to check out and it was only 9.99 on sale because it's holiday so 10 bucks for this amazing yankee candle and then i also scored at hobby lobby because everything by the paper studio is 50% off and I turned in my lottery ticket. I got some bullet journal st sticker pack. I got day-to-day -day sticker pack. I got floral sticker pack. I got the like flowerish. I like the designs on this sticker packs. And then I got stencils. Now these were all half off. This planner, they didn't have a big planner selection. This is an 18 month. So I'm going to repurpose because um, it starts in July of 2020 to December 2021. I'm going to repurpose some of those pages for other things. But this is my my new planner. I opted for the smaller planner instead of going with the, the large one. I did look at the paper studio planners and I just, I'm not a fan of them. I like this. I do not like these discs. I'm going to replace them because I have metal discs. These are plastic. I hate plastic discs. And I did buy um, a journaling sticker pack. I really want the plain boxes or the colored boxes and I cannot find them anywhere. These are pretty good though because they're at least just like plain ones. So I got these and then the lady told me if I go on their website and pull up their coupon for Hobby Lobby, they have a 40% off and they scan it off of my phone. So they scanned that and then I got 40% off and you guys, it was so amazing. Got all this stuff, all this stuff for the price of my lottery tickets. $45. I just turned in lottery tickets that I got and basically it was free. Look at those bratwurst. Beautiful bratwurst cooked in there. Oh, I will never get tired of this ninja. Never. So happy for it. Thank you so much. I can smell that chorizo. Smell that chorizo. All right, let me put the rest in. All right, so instead of having the pork rinds, I decided to go with some cottage cheese. I have one regular brat and one chorizo brat and then some cottage cheese. I'm also gonna be having a rain because tonight is New Year's Eve, baby, and I'm gonna be up all night playing video games. Mm -hmm.